Hey guys, it's Lily LPS here, and today's video is a bit different. I've never done a story time video before, so I thought I would try it out. And before I get into it, I'm not going to be using any names because I don't want to throw anyone under the bus, you know? So, yeah. Because I don't really fully know if they're a proper scammer. But of how I see it, I'm pretty sure they scammed me, but you might have a different opinion. I'm just hoping they didn't scam me, and this, what they say is true, so yeah. So let's get into the video. So, a while ago, it was like back in December or Jan- no, I'm pretty sure it was January, at the start of the year. On Instagram, you know how lots of people advertise their LPS? And one day I saw these good LPS, like my dream LPS. It was actually this one and this one here, but it had the white bit on top of it. But yeah, anyways, they were selling them for $25 each and I thought that was a pretty good deal. And it came to a total of $50. And I was like, this is a really good deal because it's just, I've never seen these LPS being sold for a decent price like that. And I have never really bought overseas before, but that didn't matter to me because I was so happy that I finally found these LPS for a good price. And then I checked out their account and they had heaps of LPS that I really liked. And I was like, I am going to buy from this person. So I messaged them asking them if the LPS was still available and they said yes they were. And then they said, is there any other LPS you'd like? And I said, I'd look through your account. And I did. And there was Collies for like $20. And Great Danes and Dash Hands. And they were just really good prices. But I decided I would get around 40 LPS. And it came to a total of $100. Which is like a really good deal. Because she like was really nice. And I knew that she wouldn't scam me and this was going to just be a great deal because I was getting so many of my dream LPS. And yeah, she was in like Europe. I'm not going to say a specific area because I don't want to, again, throw her under the bus. <laughs> I'm just going to say she's from France. So it was my first time buying overseas and I was buying quite a few LPS and it was for $100 and I was super happy with these. And she said she was going to ship them the next day and I was like okay that's awesome because we just paid her and everything on PayPal and stuff and yeah by the way if you ever buy from someone online make sure you pay on PayPal <laughs> I'll explain more later I have traded with someone in Europe before around the same area and yeah I was like it's only gonna take two weeks because that's how long it took for my package to come from that area and I was like okay it's gonna be two weeks or three weeks so yeah two weeks later it still didn't show up and I was like oh it's not here I was a bit disappointed and then three weeks later it still didn't arrive and I was like what is happening so I messaged her telling her it still hasn't arrived and I don't know what's happening and she said she sent it and all and I told her I'd keep her updated if anything else happened and she said okay so yeah I didn't think she was scamming me yet but like it seemed kind of suspicious and it was just like what is my package doing because a month later it still didn't show up like a month later that's a long time to wait for a package like a long time and a month later I thought it was a great idea hey let's buy more LPS from her because she was advertising more LPS for sale and I was like this is awesome I'm gonna buy more LPS from her because maybe this package will show up so I chose around a hundred LPS and it was two hundred dollars I'm pretty sure and yeah two hundred dollars of around a hundred LPS and I was like, okay, this is awesome because there's so many main five pets and there's more LPS and it's a great deal. And I was like, this, this is just such a great deal. And this one will be sure to come. So a few weeks later, it didn't show up. She said that she would add like a fan art for me because as an extra type for like 
um, sorry that it didn't, her last package didn't show up yet. She was like, what is your mascot? I'll draw you a drawing of it. And I was like, oh, it's this bunny. And she was like, okay, I'll draw it for you. So yeah, I was like, oh, she's really nice. So I'm sure she wouldn't scam me. So yeah, a few weeks later, I was waiting for both packages because I was still a bit fed up. And I was like, okay, the second package has got to come. And it didn't show up. And a month later, it still didn't show up. So I messaged her saying, so, um, where's the package? Like, I'm not saying you scammed me or anything, but like, did you actually send the package? And she said, yes, she did. And yeah, it was really weird. And she started to ignore me like a couple weeks later. Or like I think it was a month later I was like the package still isn't came and yeah she started ignoring me so I knew she had another account that was still her because I said at the same age she was the name that was in her bio and that the country she was from was included in it so I was messaged to that account saying hey the package still isn't came and then like, do you know anything about if we could contact the post service and ask them about it? I know this couldn't be true or anything, but sh that account messaged me saying this is the wrong person. But I knew it was the right person because it had the same name as her selling account, her LPS account, same age, same country, same language, and it was just really weird. But uh, we decided that, like, we'd just contact her through PayPal because I told my mom that like she wasn't responding to me through Instagram so we me emailed her through PayPal because that's how we paid for it so yeah we were like so could you check the post office and because there is still a way we can track the package because we went to the post office a few times asking if there's anything we can do about the package and like how we can find it and things and what was the situation that happened and they said the person who sent the package can start an investigation to find it because there will be a way to find it and so we explained that to her and she said sure she'll go to the post office on the weekend and she said there was nothing she could do about it and that she didn't want to go to the post office so another month later we message PayPal saying could we get a refund because our package still hasn't came and it's been like I think four months and yeah we should get our money back because it was $300 on LPS and if they weren't there we should probably get our money back and if you use PayPal and you don't pay the money back you get a bad review they delete your account and yeah since you've not trustworthy they delete your account so you don't have a PayPal account and obviously you want a PayPal account so she eventually paid the money back and we got our money back but it's been about seven months or almost eight months and the package hasn't came but around this time I haven't received four packages two trade packages and two packages I bought from the same person and it's just a bit strange because one of them was in New Zealand which is the country I am in and then one of them was in America well two of them were in Europe so it was kind of a bit weird because at first we were like like a package can get lost easily because everyone's sending mail and it's easy to get lost but two packages to get lost was just like mmm what's going on here because we're like she's either scamming or it actually did get lost because I haven't received four packages and it's just weird so yeah so the conclusion of this story time is number one make sure the person you are buying or trading with is a hundred percent trustworthy number two always use PayPal to buy things online because you can easily get your money back and and it's just a whole lot easier to manage your LPS buying or whatever you're buying. I either got scammed or my post service is just really bad. So yeah, comment down below what you think happened because I'm still not sure what happened. Like I'm really annoyed about because I could have had like 150 of my dream LPS but no. 
So yeah, thank you guys so thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you want more story times, make sure to like this video and let me know in the comments. And subscribe for more videos every Wednesday and Sunday. Or if you're in America or places like that, every Tuesday and Saturday. So yeah, stay tuned for more videos. Bye guys!